check. What's up, Jaycationers? Welcome to day seven of Vlogmas. Today is gonna be another rawish vlog. Um, we're gonna talk about my Starbucks mugs collection. Um, I've gone all over the world and tracked these Starbucks mugs down. Um, it just became a little like uh, obsession of mine when I was traveling to Europe and um, I just liked the designs of the mugs and I just really started to like them. So I started this collection. Um, this right here behind me is all of the United States of America. These are the you are here mugs or aka yeah mugs I've gone to most of these spots. This is basically a map shelf of the United States of America, of course And um, I got this at Pottery Barn Kids. It was like 300 something dollars But it was just awesome. It's just such an awesome thing to have like it's really unique to have a United States map shelf, but uh, I put everything almost to accordance to where each city is and state. It's just kind of hard to pin them exactly where they're supposed to, but check it out. So that's California. You got San Fran, LA, Tahoe, OC. That's home. These are mostly Texas and New Mexico. Then we head over to the deep south and you go to Alabama, NOLA. I love NOLA. NOLA is like one of my favorite places. Uh, you got Miami, Charlotte, and the Florida mug down there, and the Panhandle. Then you go up more, and you hit Tennessee, Virginia, Washington, D.C., up to New York. And I hung hooks on these for Pittsburgh, Philadelphia. Then you got the Great Lakes region with Detroit, Illinois, Chicago. Then you got the Midwest, KC, St. Louis. Um, that's Indianapolis, Nashville. Head over to the Rocky Mountains for Denver, Colorado. Up here, I had to put Dale and Aspen. I mean, it should be down there, but I had some fillers. And up there in Montana, they don't got Starbucks mugs. Um, Twin Cities up there. And then here, go to the Great Northwest, Portland, Oregon, Pike's Place. That's the first ever Starbucks. Um, Seattle and Washington State. That's most of the set of the United States. Um, I have a few more. I have the complete United States set, but I couldn't fit them all in here and that's just the way I wanted to set it up. Let's go on to the next display. And there's my Christmas village. So this display right here is a circle shelf. Um, it's pretty unique. I like how all the rows are divided differently. And um, I got this at the World Market. I'd like to say it was like $129 when I bought it. But yeah, it's really cool and unique. I put all my Icon mugs from Europe on here in accordance to country and trip. So let me explain it to you. These are some parts of Spain, Malaga, Valencia, Sevilla. Um, got the Nice one. These were from 2015 when I went with Jeff to Belgium and got Frankfurt, Namur. It's really cool. And then these are when I went to Hungary with my dad in, uh, we were at Prague. These are other Germany and Copenhagen mugs. Now down here, I tried to get a little creative. I basically found this frame hook in Target and found pictures of each city I went to. They have certain landmarks of that city design, so check this out. So that's me next to the mannequin piss statue. And the Belgium mug is the mannequin piss statue. So that's pretty cool. That's me in Alicante, this really cool white building. And that's the exact same white building on there. Notre Dame a la garde with me and Mari. And that's Notre Dame a la garde from Marseille. This isn't quite the castle in Monaco, but um, it's, it's inland of it. And that's the castle of Monaco. The Czech Republic with the clock tower. I don't know if this is the same clock tower, probably not, but that's the astronomical clock in Prague, which is really cool, me and my dad took a picture of. And then on top of that are the mini espresso shot glasses of Belgium, Barcelona, Spain, Marseille. Prague and the Czech Republic. So yeah, that's kind of how I organized that side. Just a little random. Next up, I found this surfboard. It was really cool. And this is a special Hawaii mug. And then mom added the leprechauns from Ireland. Also behind it are the uh, You Are Here mug uh, water bottles. The glass water bottles, so I have a few of those. Next up is this heart shelf that I picked up at Target also. A little cheaper, it's about like 29 bucks. Um, I went to Australia, if you guys remember on Jaycation, Australia and New Zealand, and these are the Australia and New Zealand Global Icon mugs. Auckland and New Zealand were both sold out when I went there, so I picked these up on eBay, but it still counts. I went there and they just didn't have them. But I picked the rest of these up. I got Brisbane, Gold Coast, Melbourne, Sydney, and 
Australia and then I just put the Australia Espresso shop mug there. Ever since I've left, they have the You Are Here mugs now and I'd like to collect those eventually, but you know, I got these so I'm not greedy. Now these mugs here are fire relief mugs. They have the names of the cities in the inside. That's Seattle, that's Auckland, and Wellington. I'd actually like to go back to New Zealand one day. I only spent like three days there, so. I got this at Michael's. This was like 40 bucks, I think. It's pretty cool. Fits the mugs just perfectly. Um, these are mostly like Disney themed You Are Here mugs. And down here are like Canada and all the rest of the United States that are just gonna fit onto the map. Up here, I got Disneyland, Orange County, California Adventure, which they have new ones out now. I got Orlando, Magic Kingdom, Epcot, Disney Hollywood Studios, and Disney's Animal Kingdom. And then up here is Waikiki, Hawaii, Phoenix, Vegas, Montreal, Calgary. I got this at Ikea, and this is one of the first uh, shelves that I bought when I first started the collection. And you got Alaska, Toronto down there, Jersey, the Hamptons, Boston, Cambridge. Just wanted to put them over in this side because I couldn't fit them in the map wall. Next up is this cross light shelf that I put behind me. I got this at Target also, it was like 30 bucks. Um, I did a mix of things. So you got the Melbourne, Sydney, Australia espresso shots, some ornaments, uh, that's a Seattle ornament and Disneyland. Um, got some special Vegas and Times Square mugs. And in the middle, I have the acrylic coffee mug from New York, Vegas, and New Orleans. And these are the California and special Disney ones. Moving on to this birdhouse right here. Um, I got a little creative, got this at Michael's. So they were on sale after Christmas. I don't know, it was probably like 30 bucks or so. This was just like when I went on a special trip. So I went on a stopover to Dusseldorf, Germany. So I got these little ones. I didn't think that I should get a big one because it really wasn't a trip. And then uh, Paris, France. This trip was from 2013 when I went to Spain with the Vamoxes boys, actually. Vamoxes boys, if you guys are wondering, is Cito, Justin, and Matt, and we saw them at the Best Man Speech vlog. And Cito was the one that got married. And in here are very special mugs to me. I got this my very first time in Barcelona. That's Casa Batillo. Comment below, please tell me, is it Batillo, Batlo, Batlo? Ah, I'm trying, I'm trying. And this is that Madrid mug with a bear hug in the tree. And down here is Don Quixote and Sancho Panza for Spain. These mugs particularly mean a lot to me because that was my first time ever in Spain and that's when I started falling in love with the city of Barcelona. And now I live there, so that's really cool. Now here's the far shot of it. Yeah, it's a massive wall, guys. It's crazy, right? It's a little too much. But uh, yeah, to even it out, I went and put this uh, birdhouse here. And this is mainly California um, icon mugs. And these icon mugs are discontinued and pretty pricey. Um, of course, home needs to be featured, San Diego, California. But then inside here, you got Frisco, LA, and Orange County. This is a random Ho Chi Minh City of Vietnam mugs that my friends have given me um, through their travels. Um, I haven't gotten very many but some friends wanna gift me some, so that's pretty cool of them. Now, this is the giant one. This is the one I first started off with where I put my mugs before the collection blew up. Um, got this double shelf in Ikea, like 80 bucks, I think, something like that. Maybe even cheaper. Um, but yeah, I put all of the Icon mugs here and these are like mo mainly original mugs that I bought through the years. Up here, you got London, Australia, Munich, Berlin, some Germany places. Um, I got all of these actually in Athens, in Athens Starbucks, but I did go to Mykonos, a few other of these places, so I have the whole set. And then one of my friends gave me this Rio mug. Oh, it was Jeff, my friend Jeff. He did the best man speech. And then there's other London and England ones, so this is like the first ever London England ones compared to this one, which is like a newer version. You got Copenhagen, Denmark, which me and Mama and Jello did a few months ago, but I got this on a stopover back then. Lisbon, Portugal, you've seen that on Jaycation with me and Madi. And Amsterdam, Netherlands, you've seen me there uh, this, this year recently for VidCon Europe. So it's pretty cool. There's like a story to all these mugs and that's why it means a lot to me because I look at these mugs and you just remember like these places you've been in your whole life and your travels. And that's what really uh, it's all about. That's why I collect them because it's just like really cool thing to look at and say hey I've been there and brings like good memories from 
the time you were there. Really good conversation piece when you got visitors, even like when you're with your parents and Jello, and they're like, yeah, I remember that time we were in Lisbon, that was such a great time. But anyways, on to the next one. So the second half, you got Germany, Manila, Tagaytay, Peru. Tagaytay, that's actually where Ate Marisa is from, and that's where Ate Marisa, Sunny, and Cyril are at the moment. Um, you got Boracay, one of my favorite places in the world, where hopefully I get married someday. That's Manila, Makati, and the Philippines. We haven't been to the Philippines in a while. I haven't been there since 2012 for Jeff's wedding. We went to Boracay and Palawan, but I wasn't quite vlogging yet. I have footage. Hopefully this year, we'll head to the Philippines. On to Seattle, Pike Place Market, Lake Tahoe, Vegas, New Orleans, Chicago, Indy. I worked the Super Bowl at Indy and I got it then. Um, Vietnam, Boston, New York, DC. One of my good friends, Brian, um, shout out to Brian. And, uh, I got this at a Target there. I remember that. I had to run in. He was making fun of me, but I got it. So cool. Now up high, we're starting to run out of room here. Up high is a trip that I took in 2015. My first ever solo trip. If you guys have never gone on a solo trip before, I totally recommend it. There's nothing more freeing. It gives you this feel of independence and you're so much more open to meeting new people. It's awesome. But anyways, this is like a zigzag shelf that I got in Target also and this is when I went to Northern Ireland and Ireland and Scotland. So at the very top you got Manchester and the Stonehenge England and you saw the other version of Benjamin Franklin for England. That's Northern Ireland. That's the Ireland mug with the harp. Next to it is Dublin and the canal area. Cambridge, Edinburgh, Scotland and Glasgow. I actually started kind of vlogging around that time, but it was so cold, I still didn't have any equipment, and I just didn't film or vlog that time. I don't know why. Like, I already started, like, with my Greece vlogs and whatnot, but, like, for some reason, that winter, I just took pictures of this whole trip, and it was crazy, because I went on a Game of Thrones trip, but, like, yeah, Glasgow was great. I had so much fun in um, Edinburgh. Maybe one day we'll be back. Maybe Starbucks will see this and sponsor me, and take me to these places, and we'll go on, like, a little scavenger hunt for these Starbucks uh, mugs. Starbucks, if you're listening. Next up are these two. These are more places that I've been to. You got Cologne, you got Germany, Salzburg, Vienna. We went to Vienna earlier this year. Switzerland, Zurich, that's where my homegirl Mimi is. Bye bye Mimi, what's up? I went back to Lucerne 2010 on my first ever Top Deck tour. Then you got Stockholm, Sweden, where Madi went on a stopover. Finally over here are festival mugs. Um, you got Oktoberfest, Carnival, and I got these while I was at Germany. Every year Oktoberfest has a new mug, so that's one. I think that's the newest one. That's Carnival, I got that in Cologne. And that's another Oktoberfest. I think Jason gave that to me, and Jason's actually on his way over right now. There's Lyon, France, Bern, and a few more Switzerland places in Geneva, Basel, St. Gallen. So yeah, that's my huge Starbucks wall. Um, anyways, let's knock on wood. Big earthquake doesn't happen and they don't get knocked over. Finally in the rooms, I have a few other mugs. <laughs> this is out of place, this is a Dunkin' Donuts mug. This is from the first ever Starbucks store. It just commemorates the first ever Starbucks. This is a Chinese New Year mug that I got as a present. And this is Vashon Island, Washington. It has nothing to do with Starbucks, but my friend gave it to me. And since I'm running out of room, all the mugs I've been collecting recently are going in my room. So up top, I have all the newer mugs that I've been collecting that you've seen me pick up on the vlog. So check it out. You got Universal Studios Hollywood, Ramstein, that's where Jeff works, um, Copenhagen, Denmark, Budapest, Frankfurt, Munich, Paris, Philippines, another Amsterdam mug. And finally, Lakers game's going on. They're kind of winning right now, but it looks like the Sixers are coming back. But uh, these are the last ones. These are Christmas Year Here mugs that I picked up last year on my winter trip. I got Paris, London, and Berlin. We actually will be in Berlin for this Christmas. So stay tuned for those videos. And then you got Madrid, Barcelona, which is basically home for me now in Spain. And Edinburgh, which is one of my favorite cities in the UK. I wish I could have filmed it more formal, but I'm running out of time here. I'm going back to Barcelona tomorrow, so I need to just hurry it up. Anyways guys, I hope you enjoyed the tour of my Starbucks mug collection. I know it's vast, there's a lot of it, but I love it. I've been to most of these places and like it's just really cool. Like, who has a United States map with a bunch of Starbucks mugs? Do you guys collect Starbucks City mugs? What's your favorite Starbucks mug? And how do you display your stuff? Comment below, I want to know. Um, maybe even see some pictures of your guys' displays, but this is my favorite display, the USA. Alright, Jaycationers, that's it for this episode of Vlogmas. Hope you enjoyed it. Comment, like, and subscribe if you haven't yet, and uh, yeah, check out my mugs. That's it for tonight. Happy Holidays.